kids welcome to the maths class today topic of our class is ascending order the objective of our learning today is number 1 what is ascending order and number 2 how to arrange different numbers in ascending order now let us start with the topic kids first of all we will learn what is ascending order it means to arrange numbers from smallest to biggest that means going from the smallest number to the biggest number now i will explain it to you with the help of a figure here you will see that i have made stairs in which i have written numbers 1 2 3 4 going upwards now if i want to go from bottom step to the upper step i will go to first step then second then third and then fourth to reach from bottom to up i have to go upwards i have to go from the smallest step to the biggest step that means in ascending order ascending order means arranging smallest number to the biggest number and it is also called increasing order now i will discuss how to arrange different numbers in ascending order with the help of few examples children here i have writ uh, written few examples like different numbers are given 6 3 1 9 and 4 our first step should be write place value table like ones 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 here you will observe that all the digits are at ones place so it will be easy to compare the numbers i want you to read the numbers numbers are 6 3 1 9 4 among all these numbers you have to see which one is the smallest number that is 1 so we will take that number and write it here now again we will read all the numbers 6 3 9 4 among all these four numbers which is the smallest number that is 3 correct we will take that number and write it here again we will read the numbers 6 9 and 4 among these three numbers which one is the smallest 4 right then we will take this number and write it here again we will read 6 and 9 and comparing these two numbers 6 is the smallest one so we will take the 6 and write it here and at last we are left with 9 so we will write it here in this we have simply arranged the numbers into ascending order now coming to next step that is double digit numbers again our first step will be writing place value table that is ones tens ones tens ones tens ones tens ones tens here we come to know that all the digits are written in ones and tens place now children listen carefully here we have to underline the first digit that means the digit which is given on the tens place of all the numbers like this now we will only compare the numbers which we have underlined we will read the numbers that is 2 4 1 2 3 among these underlined numbers which one is the smallest one correct so we will write 16 first after writing 16 we will again read the numbers which we have underlined 2 4 2 3 now here 2 is coming two times that means twice now if this situation comes we will shift to the ones place digit that is 9 and 4 now comparing ones place digit 4 is the smallest one and 9 is the biggest one 
then we will write 24 first and after 24 we will write 29 now we are done with the three numbers now again we will read the numbers which are left 4 and 3 among these two numbers 3 is the smallest one so we will write 35 first and at the end we will write 43 here we have written these numbers in ascending order now children you might get confused in numbers when we have two digit number and one digit number both again our first step should be writing place value table ones tens ones ones tens here you can see some numbers are having two ones and tens digit and some are having only ones place digit here when you are not having any number on tens place to so here we will add zero at tens place like this now again same step underlining the digits which are given at tens place here we are done now we will read aloud the numbers 5 0 3 1 0 now again same situation that 0 is coming two times we will shift to ones place digit that is 9 and 6 6 is the smallest one so we will write 6 first after 6 we will write 9 again we will read the numbers 5 3 1 among these three numbers 1 is the smallest yes so we will write 17 first after that we will again read the numbers 5 and 3 now among these two 3 is the smallest then we will write 31 and at the last we will write 5 to 52 I hope I am clear with my topic and now I want you to open your maths today at page number 11 and do sum number 17. Thank you.